Welcome back to my latest nine ball breakout review. Tim here to break it all down for you. Make sure to smash that like button if you wouldn't mind too terribly. And sub to the channel, of course, because I got videos coming out every day. This is getting insane. And you're going to see some insane backspin on some of these shots here. And I'm going to talk about that. Looks like we make the three on the break, and then the two ball also goes. So pretty nice break, um, except that the cue ball ends up right on the bottom rail here, which is not ideal, obviously. I'm going to try to hit this one ball in all the way up table. Not easy, and looks like the lead just barely gets there. I'm going like get there, get there. Okay, I got there. Nice. And we, all of a sudden, we only got six balls left on the table. Okay, so I just got a, a little top spin on this one. I haven't used any crazy backspin yet, but it's coming. Just wait. Just hold your horses. All right, set this one up like perfectly, pretty much. If you're looking to get straight in, which is actually fine in this case. Draw it back for the six ball. Now, I don't want to like backspin it too much, but a decent amount. It actually goes a little askew, which is good because it gets right up on the six ball. Uh, with a little bit of angle, and with this angle, this is actually perfect. If I can power backspin it into the rail and back out to the middle of the table for the seven, That'd be perfect. I think I tried to power this so much I almost missed the shot. But yeah, you can see the zip as it squeals out back into the rail and then into the middle of the table. And a kind of similar, similar type of shot here, a little bit of an angle in the direction that I want towards the eight ball. So I'm gonna try to Use some zip on this one as well. Yeah, like that. Uh, some zippy miracle whip or whatever they call, they used to call that stuff. Sandwich spread. Gross. Hope you guys, if you're watching this video, you're beyond the, you're, you've evolved beyond eating sandwich spread. All right, so here I want to just roll it forward. Actually, took off on me a little bit. Went further than I wanted it to. And yeah, but this isn't too bad of a shot. It's got a pretty. This is a pretty nice angle. This is like that typical thirty degree angle where you just line up the tip of your cue right to the right against the outside of the ball's edge, the object ball's edge, that is. So, I saw it pretty nicely. I mean, it didn't take me too long. Sorry if you're used to, like, an 11-minute video out of me, but this isn't that. 